everybody, good morning. This week in Old Town Kids, we are continuing our lesson series called Six Sundays of Stories, where we're learning about the parables of Jesus, those lessons that Jesus taught us through stories about how we can live lives to be more like him. And this week we're looking at a parable about two sons, two sons who make very different choices about how to live their lives, and a dad who understands both of them and loves them both. And now, as I got to thinking about this week's lesson, I thought, wouldn't it be cool if I knew actors who could act out this story? But it's kind of short notice, and I'm a low budget production, and where was I gonna find this team of actors? But then I got to thinking, and I realized I might know just the actors for the job. And I was worried they'd say no, but when I told them that it was for you, they were so excited to help out. So I hope that you will sit back, relax, and enjoy this all-star cast production of the much-beloved classic parable, The Prodigal Son. There once was a man who had two sons. Now one of the sons was feeling very tired of his life. He wanted to do something new. And so he said, Dad, give me my inheritance now. This was special money the dad had set aside for his sons for later. But the dad said yes, and he gave his son the money, and the son took his money and went off into the world. And boy, he lived large. When he wanted fancy food, he ate it. When he wanted a cool toy, he bought it. But guess what happened? He ran out of money. All of his money ran out. All of his credit cards were maxed out. There was nothing left. And then life was hard. He was hungry and he was unhappy. And then he realized something. He realized that at his dad's house, people weren't hungry. At his dad's house, people were happy. So he decided he would go home. He would admit to his dad that he made a mistake he would say that he had done a bad thing. He would say he was sorry. He didn't think he deserved to be his dad's son anymore, but maybe he could get a job working for his dad. And so he headed home. But guess what happened? While he was still far away, his dad looked out and his dad saw him. And his dad was so happy to see his son, so he ran to him. He hugged him and he kissed him, and he picked him up and swung him in the air. And do you know what? The dad forgave him. Forgave him for running away, forgave him for spending all the money. He was just so happy his son was home. He said, let's celebrate, let's have a party. Now remember though, there was another brother. How do you think he felt? He was a little unhappy now. All this time while his brother was away, the other brother had been at home working hard. He hadn't had fancy things or wasted money. There'd never been a party for him, even though all this time he had done his chores and did as he was told. And his dad saw that he felt sad, felt a little hurt, felt a little forgotten. But here's what his dad said to him. He said, I love you. You are mine. You are always with me. Isn't that the best? And now your brother is here too. Isn't that even better? So let's go in and celebrate. And so they did. The end. What a great story, huh? Man, and what a good job those actors did, don't you think? Well, that's it from me for today, but I hope that you will check out this week's lesson where you can learn more about that story, and I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye.